Hey guys, just wanted to do a quick video on this uh, outdoor TV cabinet that I just made um, for my patio, covered patio. Um, just wanted to do a quick video on how, how, how I put it together. Just use some one by six on the sides and also for for the for the door um and then some one by two i guess two and a half um for the the trim also put some two two uh two and a half or one by two and a half in the back um as well um fairly um you know easy to make just you know took the measurements from my tv and and um went from there and just boxed it in um nothing too hard to put together the only thing uh i would say what was difficult or um things i wished i would have done differently um is when i made it I wish I would have went with a little bit thicker wood on top and I'll show you here in a minute why um, but uh, overall I'm uh, I'm happy with it but there's some things I would do different I did install some lift shocks um, to help with the door and keep it keep it up um things i would have done differently is i would have uh left a little bit more room on the sides to compensate for the brackets i had to cut this one down or both of them down a little bit um so it wouldn't be hitting the tv um you know i wish i would have done that different you know left a li at least you know an inch and a half maybe on each side uh maybe on top as well um and uh i've got three hinges here as you can see but if i would have went with a larger stock on top it would have helped you know with um, you know uh, giving it a little bit extra strength um, with these lift shocks now these lift shocks i got them off of amazon and they're 20 inch um lift shocks and they're 100 pounds each which is overkill um i watched another video of a guy and he said he used them and his door looked a lot lighter than what i have so that's why i went with them but i just placed an order for some uh 65 pound ones 20 inch 65 pounds each and and hopefully that'll um won't be so uh um uh, you know uh tight on my my door when i go to lift it right now it's it's a little hard to pull down i mean not too bad but you know you got to put put a little muscle in there to to bring it down and uh you know but overall i like the way it turned out i just wish i would have done a little bit differently if anybody um wants to make their own like i said one by six all the way around and um you know the trim i used uh, some old stock and then the door part is some new stock so um but like i said you know um i would have left more space on the sides to compensate for that bracket and um, put some more thicker stock up top i'm gonna have to reinforce that up top and uh because at some point it's gonna you know could rip them hinges right out so uh just wanted to do a quick video and and uh show you guys what i made thanks for watching